Hey everyone. Well, shopping's all done. I actually left the camera running on a separate video because I had a couple of guys sitting in the car and I'm going, all that shit's in my boat. Anyways, there was a parking lot guy there and I'm sure they've got it all probably cameraed up now like everywhere else. Anyways, uh, it was busy in there, but the, <laughs> I didn't even have to wait for a cash. I just as I walked up to a cash, uh, young lad there uh, that does that, you know, he uh, he opened up the cash right in front of me. I'm like, well, there's, no, that's handy. I was going to drive along the lake, but I want to get to the campground. Lake looks uh, choppy, so that's white cast. So that's nice swimming, eh? Oh, oh. only do 50 here. Got the toe function on. It's funny that you have to keep pushing that toe button every time you get in, but I guess it's so you don't forget when you're not hooked up. Somebody staying at Woodland Park. Wish you all the luck and your little anal retentive pavement campground. It's not even a campground, man. I don't know how you call that a campground. The name campground should not be applied to that place. And I wasn't too cool with the family there either. Like 10 o'clock at night or what it was, or 11. It's like no fire. You got to put it out. No talking. And I'm like... What is this, man? Like, fucking... You know? It's supposed to be fun. That's what camping's all about. People stay up late. No, they shouldn't be blasting music unless it's a weekend at White Sands when we're all having a big party and on the go. You know, but, I mean, there's a family section at White Sands, so you can get away from it if you don't want to be in the group section, which I don't, but I'm close to the group section with the new site that I stay at now. So... But I'm okay with all that. Anyway. That's his problem. Not mine. So I got some bacon. I got some onions. Some potatoes. And some bread. And some buns. And I'm officially broke until my deposit comes in. Like I say, I expect it tomorrow morning. So... It's always like three or four in the morning when they deposit. Well, the SO's still there. What's the price of gas in the Great Sable Beach? Dollar sixty-three. Not the end of the world, I guess. It's pretty close to what it was where I where I live. So one half dozen of the other where I get the gas for the boat. Oh, well, maybe I should remember to use the internet because I'll have my laptop. And it'll be easier for me. And I'll type in Wyarton gas station gas prices. I'm sure they'll have them. Because that's, you know, the first place I'm going to launch the boat anyway. Familiar water. Because I didn't have time to boat test it in one of our lakes. Like I would have wanted to. But, you know, things piled up. We got busy. Then True was busy. And... And last minute with the Scotty downrigger. So ooh, look at the trails. Oh, I can't wait to go riding. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. As they say. Oh yeah. Not, well, not, as they say, that's what Randy Macho Man Savage used to say. Oh yeah. Mr. Slim Jim Man. Wasn't one of my favorite wrestlers. But some of the greatest matches I've ever seen had Randy Savage. Him and Ricky Steamboat, WrestleMania 3. Not a whole lot of matches out there that could top that one, if any. One of the greatest matches, uh, definitely the, one of the greatest matches of uh, WrestleMania. Technical and all that. Yeah, a few of them. I can't take any away from his anything away from his uh, his wrestling you know experience and all that you know he's a very good wrestler it's just his persona it was like a little much for me man then it's like 
he's like this all the time, which I guess, you know, he's old school wrestling, that's keeping your thing on, but, I mean, he really is like he is, like, that was, I don't even think that was an act, I think that's how he really is, or was. I couldn't listen to that voice for more than a couple of days, and I'd have to move far away. So what's Sable Fee, Sable Falls, Provincial Park look like? It's a nice camp now, I like this one. Da, da, da. Never stayed at it, we almost did though. We had a site that we were looking at that was right along the river. Firewood, firewood, oh, Sable, I checked this campground out. This one would be an alternate if White Sands were to go away on me or something. They're not going anywhere, but. It's one of the closest alternatives I could live with. We're almost there, folks. There's my ATV trails. Wow. Must have rained the last couple of days because I see puddles down there on the trails. So and it's pretty sandy down here. So the puddles pretty much soak through pretty quick, I expect. job out here taking care of these trails. I have to say I'm very impressed. South Bruce Peninsula ATV Club I think is the name. I'll have to go look it up. I'm probably going to have to go get a, a week pass or something. It's not my backyard so I don't mind paying for you know fees and then I don't have enough money for a year one. Oh, here's, uh, what is this one called? Yeah, North Sobble. Families only now. They totally changed that campground around there. I think it was a situation there too. It was like during the week, place is empty, you know, the, and they still have all the operating expenses, you know, staff and all that. See, White Sands is family run, so the whole family works there. White Sands, I can't remember a time it was any kind of different campground. It's just always been the way it is. First time we ever went there and we fell in love with it immediately. And of course, the owners, Lisa and Joe Pringle, couldn't meet better people. And what they're doing here. Around just 10 it'll be about yeah it'll be 10 after 5 that's not bad I left at 9 30 so with stops and a couple of construction slowdowns and stuff that was uh, what just about eight hours oh there's my turn right here almost was gonna go past can't be doing that I wonder if anybody's up in the office now would be the next question Do not enter. Oh no, they got a trailer there. I don't think that was there before. Oh no, it was, okay. I should have gone in that other way. Shit. Okay, I'm okay. As long as I don't clip the side of the boat, we're doing okay. Okay, folks, I'll be turning you off for a moment. <laughs> 